knowledge junction do like share and subscribe for latest videos today we are learning mathematical type setting in latex which is a scientific writing software pronunciation of latex how to the word text come from tau epsilon chi the last word is not x it is chi or ki even though latex should be pronounced as latex learning objective how to get into and leave from the mathematical mode the role of spaces and how to create them mathematical symbols ams maths package and its use in creating matrices system requirement recording it on uh, laptop which is cost uh, around 10000 easily can be recorded you can record on ubuntu text studio on latex you required text studio studio on window or mac can use without text studio also other linux system are all also okay with it pre request for this tutorial that introduce latex explore to the side by side tutorial all available at this website which is which is my website wordpress.com slash proindhankar dot wordpress dot com so i shall use the file here math dot text which is also available code file in the website along with this tutorial and i am attaching a pdf file of tug india uh it's a chapter number 11 which is totally on mathematical concept mathematical things so we shall use it when we do assignment so i'm come back here on my text file as i have already open it you can see this is math dot text which is so i frame it as slash document class and i put font on 12 pt and paper size is a4 paper and article and use geometry package here uh, the horizontal vertical side uh, spacing is 4.5 cm and of course title is tutorial on mathematical type setting so we start it with slash begin document and uh, i'm coming for new page so that's why i need new page so that's why i, I command is slash new page here and i mark as slash section which is introduction so i put say introduction like the text is at its best while producing mathematical document if you want to test the power of text do type set some mathematics in the forward of the text book krint writes uh, text is a new type setting system intend for the creation of beautiful books and especially for books that contain a lot of mathematics latex has a special mode of type setting mathematics mathematical text within a paragraph or in line is entered between say end so you can just look over it how the end is written between to between two dollars and and uh, between maths begin and and this 
and here you can see the preview outcomes of this so the end one end is this type and all so all are similar so you can be right in different different mode these ends and different different modes so normally large mathematical equations and formula are typesetted in separate lines in display mode to produce this we enclose them between and between this and and this produce formula or which are not numbered if we want to produce equation numbers we have to use equation environment so the spacing for both inline and displayed mathematics is completely controlled by text so this is the beautiful things in the text latex so here we started maths in text i know i name as it maths in text so here i'm going one by one so you can see the as i i have written 2.1 fraction so you can in name as say slash subsection and put because i just write mathematics so i put double dollar on both side and slash fraction slash frac you write and here like you have to be curly bracket and write whatever you want and then close it and then again you have to open a curly bracket and then close it so the one fraction come so as you can see d epsilon upon d epsilon and here slash qr q card is it is a space so here you can see the space between them and then again i started with slash fraction and fraction fraction and fraction we can do here you can see the fraction upon fraction like this and now if you want to put something in equation so don't put the blank line between the dollar sign delimiting the mathematical text text assume that all the mathematical text being type set in is in one paragraph and a blank line is started a new paragraph so consequently this will generate an error message if you put otherwise like you cannot leave it some spaces that's why for spacing you have to write some command so now our next target equation with numbers so as i have written so you have to be command for this slash begin equation and end with this slash end equation and has uh, you can see here in the right hand side the output of this they I, this is my equation which is written in left and right both side and i numbered as uh, i not i uh, even latex give it is number as number one you have you don't worry to give it a number it will automatically give it numbering and then if you don't want to give number to your equation so equation without number so there are two three ways where you use your equation without numbers so here i shown uh, you just write slash begin display maths and equation and uh, this equation with the end command slash end display maths so here you can see the equation integration minus infinity to infinity e to power minus x square equal to integration minus infinity to infinity double integration and same minus infinity to infinity e to power minus x square plus y square dx dy either one way otherwise you put on double uh, dollar sign or otherwise slash capital bracket and then end with the slash capital bracket so these are the three ways where you can put equations without numbering here the next section uh, equation sub equations so here you can uh, use 
command for sub equations like this slash uh, begin equation slash begin equation and you can make it sub equations of them then you can frame if you want to frame your equation so you can easily frame it as frame displayed equations so you just be uh, right start your equation with slash begin equation and then slash f box and then curly bracket you have to close it like curly bracket and then in the single dollar sign you have to put your equation then the equation comes in a bracket as we had you can see the output of this then if you have inquire query there are multiple line equations so you can write multiple line equations you can write command with equ equin array equation array right so start with begin and end with uh, end of course then the this command it is multiplied and your equation comes on one numbering and here there is a command slash no numbering so after this no numbering the first equation is have no number and then second number second or third whichever you want you can give to a number that like slash no number is used for suppressing numbers and then matrices you can use double door command because I don't want to give number and uh, slash matrix and then can write your matrix by end end so it comes like uh, if you use end end so your equation is like this 1 2 3 th 2 3 4 4 5 uh, th uh, 3 4 5 like this the matrix so you just be slash uh, slash cr command for next line column this is for column next column next column yeah it comes in next row wise or otherwise you can make a bracket uh, uh, with a with a bracket uh, your matrix and then you can use array command to produce simple uh, slash begin array and then you use array equations and here your equation comes look like this then some type um, you want cases so double dollar and then you use slash cases command and then you can put your cases cases one or cases two like x equal to zero or x not equal to zero then the, this case comes like this and then structural so you can be used like this atop atop for atop you can be used like this slash sum for summation and uh, likewise slash squat for square root and for some numbering if you want for choose number optional things if you want to slash choose so you can put your options one two like this and now it is very useful for uh, defining theorems so like uh, slash begin theorem thm so your output comes theorem number one and then slash remark rmk if you use so it produce remark and then slash C uh, callery C O L you, if you use begin callery then end with of course all things will be end up when you start with anything uh, begin slash begin the, you have to be end slash end that particular name so like this slash call um, callery call and then lemmas for lemmas also slash L E M and slash end with the slash end uh, lem slash exa for example exa use for example and uh, then end with this end with this exa 
so let me show you this is the uh, pdf file which i have attached with my uh, text uh, code file so easily you can find on my website these two files so you can be easily make it useful for you so here you can have a look that all mathematical symbols are given in the page number 12 this all mathematical symbols you can see very easily lower greek letters upper greek letters and then if we come uh, this math mode ascent uh, binary operation symbols uh, relation symbols array symbols miscellaneous symbols all all things are given which is uh, entirely useful in mathematics by knowing this you are very comfortable and easily uh, make mathematics uh, mathematics things by using um, this so in summary in this tutorial we learned the following things entering and leaving the mathematical mode using spaces and creating them fractions subscript and superscript defining an argument with braces ms maths packages to create matrices so i'm giving some kind of assignment which is useful for you you can be used it for your uh, for your making bet uh, learning better to better so first four spaces we left a, a space between alpha and a in the tutorial now leave the uh, leave different length of a spaces using these commands these are the three different commands so you can use slash and skip slash quad slash q quad so you just find how much uh, space it comes so how do the how do these spaces compare with the one we created in the tutorial so number two between alpha and a now leave a similar spaces with the command slash slash comma comma slash comma this command for slash comma you can see and then fraction so we want to create a b upon c d so what happen if you give this command slash frac a b c d without braces so just explain what does the following command result in if slash frac a b plus one bracket slash c d minus one so create this fraction a upon b plus one by c so if you use slash d frac in place of slash frac what happened for slash d frac to work you need to use the package ams ams maths so subscript and superscript if you want to create x a b we uh, will the following command work this explain or reproduce this command slash int minus uh, slash infinity cap slash pi by 2 dx x dx what do the command slash int and slash pi do does it make sense to use slash fraction in the above then matrices uh, we have used the following command to build matrices slash matrix slash b matrix so try instead of the following commands slash p matrix slash b matrix v matrix slash capital v matrix remember uh, remember to use the package ams maths various symbols try the symbol on page 12 and 13 of the chapter 11 prn pdf that has been distributed in this tutorial so package use the package ams symbol try try command on chapter 
page 14 and 15 of chapter 11 and uh, re uh, reproduce as many command as possible from uh, this chapter 11 so this file has been distributed with this tutorial you may copy and paste directly from the PDF if a does not work see a package has been used paragraph indent we used a command that remove paragraph indent delete this command and repeat the tutorial what does this command do try this command in other uh, text spoken tutorial thank you very much for watching my videos do like share and subscribe for new latest videos and thank you being with me with this scientific learning journey thank you thank